Hello, hello, I hope everybody's doing well. Today we're gonna do some uh, glass cans or soda cans, beer cans, they, they call it different ways. Um, I will show you uh, briefly, uh, you know, the materials and everything that we're gonna use, but I wanted it to jump in the computer first. This is the design that I'm gonna print. Um, I'm not going into a lot of details in here because I have another videos explaining settings and all that, um, but I just, wanted to jump here first before um, going into the materials and what we're gonna do. I, and I wanna show you guys how to do it with your Cricut mock press. So this is really, really, really simple. So let's jump here, gonna print. All right, let's go print. Here's everything that I have and I need uh, for this project. Um, this is a non-pay thing. <laughs> so these people are not paying me for saying this at all. I bought this, so uh, keep that in mind. Uh, but uh, this is the glass, uh, the glass cans that they call it. They're really small. They're smaller than what I was expecting really, um, but they're perfect for what I need. Um, they said that they are 13 ounces. Um, and it, it comes with the with the little uh, lead, and it comes with the uh, a glass uh, straw. So I don't know how confident I feel about the glass uh, straw, but you know that's what it comes with. Um, and this is the little tab uh, lead. Um, so that is cool. I like that. Um, they're really, I don't know how fragile they are, but it, it looks fragile. Um, and I, I, I bought this. This is some silicone wrap. Um, I was reading about it and it, it, it looks like you can do uh, these glasses with your Cricut uh, mug press. So that's why I bought this. They're just silicones. I really, you can use really anything, um, but I bought it because it's easier. Um, and they're, they, they have different sizes. I don't know if you can really notice, but they're different sizes. Um, and I don't know, I, I think it will work. Um, I, this is the first time that I'm doing those, these glasses with my mock press. I always do it with my oven, a little oven that I have. And you can, you have seen those in another videos, my little oven. Um, but let's do it. Let's let's work on this and, and let's see if it works amazing I love it um, the only thing that I you know that I notice is the first mama um, is not really um, I guess it did not had uh, enough pressure and maybe if I put it looking that way um, and positioning the silicone a little bit better it would make it better because everything else is good it's only the top one that I noticed that it, it, it was not enough um, pressure in some parts some other have more than others um, like this part over here have more pressure than this side over here but everything else looks amazing I love it I'm really impressed I'm really impressed I can't believe that it worked <laughs> I never had tried with this L me losing my time good god <laughs> oh, but anyway this is great I'm gonna try it one more time because I'm not gonna give up so I'm gonna put the the cup looking that way um, and I'm trying to position the silicone better to see if I can do better pressure on the machine um, so let's let's get going
so here are my glasses now it worked this is the new one and this is the old one no, the first one that we did something that I noticed um, now um, that I did not like is this they're scratching the bottom um, so they're easy to scratch on the bottom I think um, it's only when you do the sublimation so something that maybe this like to prevent this is making a little circle like paper a piece of paper in, in the form of a circle and putting some tape on the bottom that way when you put it here um, it doesn't scratch um, I don't know if it really for a customer it would really um, like it would do it like it, if, if you, you're using it like day by day it will do that um, but in the machine will do that and I had noticed that in many other uh, cups when I do it in in, in here so <clears throat> again I'm not really familiar with the day by day using these cups so I don't know I'm, I'm now I'm gonna start using it I'm gonna give one to my mom and one for me so maybe we can start using it and see um, because I, I bought this for like selling so in I'm not gonna sell this if it looks like this um, so I, that's something to keep in mind so but something to prevent it maybe do a circle and tape it um, other than that I love it I really do love it and I love how easy are like to sublimate like to do the sublimation on it so anyway it was uh, something see it, 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 this is a really simple tutorial as you can saw like you saw but if you like this video, please subscribe, press like, and share. And like always, God bless you. See you in the next video.